After suffering a sweep at the hands of the Georgia Bulldogs, the Missouri Tigers softball team rebounded with an 11-0 win in Game 1 of this doubleheader against Wichita State. They look to keep that momentum going into Game 2 and ahead into a weekend series at number 13 Kentucky. After being shut out in Game 1, the Shockers were looking for offensive improvement, but ultimately it was the Tigers' bats that would align yet again. Pick it up in the first inning, Chloe Rathburn doubles into the gap and Sammy Fagan races home all the way from first, sliding in just ahead of the throw to give the Tigers a 1-0 lead. Now in the second, Mizzou is up 3-0 and Rathburn again provides the offense, singling in two more runs to reach three RBI on the day. She would go three for four. Leading off the bottom of the third, Kirsten Mack drops a bomb to center field. That puts the Tigers up six runs. Mack went one for two with two walks and the Tigers, they're putting on an absolute clinic at the plate. But in the top of the fourth, Casey Williams steps up and delivers a two-run shot to claw the Shockers back within four runs. That, however, was the closest which Shaw State would get as the Tigers pitching staff allowed just four hits all game. But Emily Crane put a halt to the Shockers' momentum, hitting this solo shot to put the Tigers up 7-2 and Mizzou would go on to win the game 9-2. Mizzou put together two dominant performances against Wichita State today, but maintaining that level of play will be a tall task when they continue SEC play on Friday against Kentucky. From University Field, Brendan Lavelle, 23 Sports.